Aspen Glow by Susan Day is a beautiful piece of music. And it has a lot of opportunities for your students to explore tone development and phrasing. There's a lot of great writing in here, and it's enjoyable to play. And it's good for your students to come in. I mean, think of the, you, know, you have your first period orchestra class, and your students are coming in all hopped up on Pop-Tarts and Minecraft. And you can put these gorgeous melodies in front of them, have them play, and you get these 12-year-olds that are like, oh, this is what it's like to relax. Oh, I get it now. Aspen Glow is published by Grand Mesa Music Publishers, and I like to play as much stuff from that publishing company as possible. I feel like they publish music with music education in mind. Um, Dr. Dr. Walter Cummings is is a great music educator himself, and I, I really like the stuff that they put out, and I support them as much as possible. They're, they're not a sponsor for our channel. We don't really have any sponsors right now. I just like their stuff, and I would encourage you to, uh, to look through their, their library and catalog and, and check out their music. Another thing with Susan Day's compositions is they're ready to go right out of the box. Susan Day is a master-level string educator, and, and a very good violinist herself. So when she writes music, it's almost as if she's writing music for her own students. You look at it, it's very logical. You don't have to re-bow it. You don't have to re-finger it or anything like that. It's just ready to go. It, it makes sense. It lies well within the hands. It's accessible for the students. And you just set it in front of them and go. Grand Mesa sets this as a grade one plus the Texas PML has this as a grade two. So if you have an orchestra that needs to meet that grade two requirement, this is a pretty good choice because it's definitely one of the easier grade twos on the list from a, from a technical standpoint, yet from a musical standpoint, the sky is the limit. You can put this in front of an advanced orchestra and their musicianship can take them as far as they would like to go with the phrase structure of this piece of music. This might work very well for like a 3C middle school or maybe a high school non-varsity group. It's likely to provide really good contrast to the rest of the program. It seems like a lot of pieces coming out now are, are very rhythmically involved and, you know, very intense. And so, you know, you've got Aspen Glow, which is musical and lyrical and melodic, and to contrast sort of like the other, like, uh, Hand Grenade Tuesday by, uh, who is that, like, C.P. Ebach, who wrote that? But yeah, I'm a huge fan of providing students with musical opportunities where they can develop tone and phrasing and all that good stuff. I think it's, it's almost a crime if you don't program at least one piece on your program that allows them for those opportunities. You know, the other thing is, don't let that grade one plus scare you off from this, it, when played well, it does not sound like baby music. You know, it, it sounds like a real piece of art music. It's fun to play, and you can develop it to your heart's content. I really like the harmonic progressions that are used. The melodic content is, is really nice. And there's a lot of really great counterpoint in here as well. It just all comes together very beautifully and, and, and very artistically, and it's just, it's just a fun piece. If you want to use this as a, as a festival piece and really show off your students' musicality and musicianship, I think this would work really well. It might impress some judges because the phrases are predictable enough that you can teach the four-bar phrase to them and have them duplicate that scheme over the course of the piece. Now, there are a couple of phrase extensions here. There's, there's a few of them, like in measure 25 um, and measure 42 and in measure 71, but those are the exceptions to the rule and, and also not difficult to teach either. And so it, it's, it's a piece that can really show off the talents of your orchestra, and I would recommend it for a festival piece, a concert piece, or even a competition piece. Aspen Glow is a winner. Um, I've heard a lot of orchestras play Aspen Glow. I don't know that I've heard a bad performance of it. So you should give it a shot.